open sesame. <laughs> huh? Oh, well, we got it, team. And of course, it locks behind me. And they just move magically to randomize. All right, hidden study behind Mortimer's office. Let's see what you've been hiding, Lord Mortimer. All right, search Mortimer's secret study. Uh, maps, lots of maps. A fine looking map of the Orient indeed. And here, sir, your plans to intervene in Belgium are to go ahead as set down. I am to occupy the Prussian army. Uh, your delivery of cannons to Volmy has ensured our victory. As agreed, I have notified the King of Prussia of our invasion plans of Christine and the army of the north. I will keep the Austrians out of Belgium. Uh, quickly return to Paris as I sense the fate of our King Louis is about to be decided dishonorably and it is impossible for me not to intervene. Should you have any missives to give to me, I invite you to go by as per usual our friend Monsieur Peru. So Peru is um, the go-between between Mortimer and Charles Francois de Maurice. I don't know. Sorry. English is hard. Um, all right. It's locked. It's a locked gate, so I might be able to find some way into that. Um, we have a sword with a note in islands near um, near India. Let us see if you have the courage to face me Sign alone. Oh. What is she up to? Obviously, she wants to lure Mortimer somewhere, but but where? India. The only clue she's left for Mortimer is a stone sword. It must be intentional. It looks like a decorative sword, like from a statue, for example. And judging by the state of it, I'm guessing it's been left outside for a long time. I have absolutely got to find out where it came from. Okay, so I have to find that stone sword. No, I'm I'm going to Oh, go find my mother. I'll make sure to do that. Uh, so this is from John Adams. Um, Dear Lord Mortimer, I'm writing to ask you to persuade President Washington to not sign the Fugitive Slave Act as it stands. We must uh, absolutely legislate on a national level, and not allow every state to choose their policy regarding slaves. It was initially intended to resolve a conflict between Pennsylvania and Virginia. By signing it, we risk legislating um, the hunting of blacks. Um, more and more men of little faith are becoming slave hunters and unable to find any slaves on the run. They kidnap the first black they come across, which uh, they pass off as the wanted runaway. Situation threatens uh, to quickly degenerate. Interesting. I wonder if that has a horse historical context where um, Washington was willing to put it up to the states, but John Adams wanted to make it more federal. Um, I actually don't know. Sorry if you were looking for like history buffs. <laughs> Sorry. Science. Uh, let's analyze the geopolitical situation. Sea voyages being organized towards the American continent. Slaves. No doubt with slaves. Slave trade. Okay. Broken in this trade. Tens of thousands each year, according to what people say. All right, let's Great. grab huh. you. Perfect. Um, from Nikolay Nikolov. Novikov, sorry. Um, my lord, I hope this letter will reach you. My hours are numbered. My printing house has been confiscated, uh, and I am imprisoned in the fortress of Schisselberg. If by chance you could intervene in my favor, I would be internally in your debt. The Cesarina, so, Tsarina? Tsarina. Catherine, uh, should not be long in banning all Golden Order lodges from her territory. Her horizon is becoming considerably darker. Okay, so Mortimer is involved with like a billion people. Human psyche. 
by Guillaume Trimor. Hmm. He says, it is possible to drill an idea into someone by constant daily repetition until the mind gives in and goes on. There are hundreds of good ways to live life, but you only need one to convince the masses that it's the only one possible. <laughs> the author isn't letting any ethical principles get in his way, is he? Interesting. It, it's the idea of brainwash. From K. The gift has been delivered. Timur Saw Durrani, King of Afghanistan, of Punjab, of Sindh, of Mashhad, and Kashmir, um, should not retain his title much longer. Um, his son will succeed him as planned to be able to resume negotiations. Jesus. He's involved everywhere. This shows the forces present in America. Some of those forces are pushing toward the West. On it, Mortimer's placed little feather symbols at different points toward which the Spanish are headed. Could he be fueling Indian resistance to slow down Spain? Interesting. Okay. Uh, from Mohammed, my dear friend, with thanks of our service rendered and help in the fight against the Spanish in the conquest of Iran, uh, a ship bound for um, Marseille uh, in France has been chartered, uh, hidden aboard a few corpses infected with the plague that is disseminating our country at this moment in time. Be very careful when handling these boxes because if inadvertently open, you risk spreading the disease all over France. Jesus, biological warfare. From Hugh Smith, my dearest friend, as desired, I've been able to gather together my friends to sign an agreement you propose. This agreement shall be known as the Buttonwood Agreement. If you recall the place where we gathered when you met us for the first time, you will understand why this name was given. Um, please find and close a list of all my colleagues. Bleeker, Smith, Armstrong and Burnwell, March, Barclay, Sexa, uh, Siaxis? Henry Bush Reedy. Thanks for your help. We should be able to meet at my place, uh, the coffee sh uh, house. I look forward to seeing you as soon as possible. There's just so much here. Can I pick this up? Nope. I've already looked at... Have I looked at Europe? I don't know if I've looked at Europe. William, whatever your projects, it would seem that our father is against leaving you in... Uh, with a grip on Europe, Russia will soon commit itself to the coalition against your dear France. Uh, don't think you can resist for long. I beseech you, William, not to persist. You're tearing our family apart. Jesus. So he's literally just back here controlling everything that's going on in the world. Being prepared in France in favor of Italy. Could Mordor have decided to finance a war? Uh, thank you for your words, and I do understand your situa uh, situation. I regret having to confront you militarily, but if the situation obliges me to declare war, then do what you think fit. Under your advisement with a wary heart, I'm off to meet up with the coalition that opposes you. So England going against France there. Um, Thomas Jefferson, the Coinage Act has been voted. Uh, Bank of America, construction of the White House. Uh, it is still uh, due, likely due instead of die. To begin in October, we will accept no delays. You can trust me on this. There's just so much here. A chest with a motif representing the alchemical symbol of fire. Um, so I don't have the air or fire um, box, but I know that there are. That's a collectible coin. No. Key with an occult fire symbol. Okay. Seeing things, or is that an actual von Leeuwenhoek microscope? Incredible. Mortimer really is at the cutting edge of science. Even at the order, it took us ages to get one of those. So his immunity is science. Okay. I don't, I don't know if any of these 
it, it, I believe all of these are just saying that he is very well politically col uh, connected. Um, Three rusty old nails. They're about 20 centimeters long. That's crucifixion, I believe. Some goat skulls, chicken legs. Now we all know what that's for. I'm a little surprised at Mortimer. I didn't seem as the type to be organizing little pagan parties. I had no idea what that was like. powers and dancing naked under the full moon. I mean, more used to if you want to. Charms like this sold by charlatans in Pré saint gervais So it's interesting. Man of science, but also man of the Look, occult. A pack of tarot cards. Has he been reading the cards? Mortimer? <laughs> that would surprise me. Using so it many points right now. Line that answers a specific question. To the left, temperance that announces a reward for one who patiently waits before taking any action, and in the middle, the chariot, which symbolizes triumph and business success. To the right, the emperor evokes a future full of power and stability. Okay, so wait, and you'll be massively successful. Okay, there's so many things. That Hmm. That must be for writing the hoeing pigeon messages. Men fear his thunder and praise his justice. He reigns but doesn't dominate. Jesus. Um, master architect. Model of your new lock. If you appreciate my prototype, it is difficult to imagine how it all fits together, but it will be located in the middle of the present door. The aim uh, being to alter nothing of the door's functionality, but to add a bit of spice. Depending on the lineup of the wheels, the aforementioned lock will open or will punish the snooper whose faith is not strong enough. I call my invention the judgment of faith because if a snooper is unable to resist opening it, they will be punished. A skeleton by the name of Gustav, if the plaque on the plinth is anything to go by. Mortimer's given a name to his anatomy skeleton. That's morbid. Oh, it's probably the per right hand is missing. Yeah. That's that's a real person through feathers. Pigeon, probably. So examine the inscriptions first. I don't recognize the alphabet. I wonder where the pictograms are from. It is an Egyptian or Hebrew. There are two inscriptions on the sides as well as on the top. No way to know what's underneath. Absolutely no idea what it's for, but I find this cue fascinating. Looks like obsidian, obsidian or onyx. onyx. Interesting. It must weigh a ton. Oh. Um. Got a book. Something strange about this table. Seems like a dissection table. The little surgeon's perfect collection. What kind of experiments does Mortimer carry out here? It's a dissection table. Yep. So Mortimer does autopsies here on his desert island. But who is he doing autopsies on then? The the skeleton. Yeah, we already knew that immunity. Um, I think that's everything, right? Ooh, there's whatever this is. An iron mask. I wonder who it's for. Huh. I think I... Look, oh, there's a brain. Preservation using formaldehyde. Just as disgusting as ever. This is so weird. All right, I think that's everything. He's super well politically connected. We figured out his, um, uh... Oh, shit. How am I gonna get out of here now? Probably through the locked door, hopefully. Um... But, uh, we figured out that he, like, science... This is locked. Crap. Um... One, what was it? It was one one nine. Uh, 
nine one, right? This looks like the same mechanism as the one on the other side. Can I lower the lever here? Whoa, whoa. The grid closes a bit more every time I enter a wrong date. I'd, I'd better not mess up again. It doesn't seem to be working. Okay, so I need to I need to be worried about that. But also, I think what they're trying to get at is the fact that um, these are all on uh, the same wheel. And so um, I need to figure out what's on the opposite side of um, of one. So and I and I need to reverse the pattern. So basically um, zero on the opposite side of that is five. One is six. Two is seven. Three is eight and four is nine. So what I want to do here is get a six. And I know that looks weird. That's also a six. Shoot. I, I put it in wrong anyways. Uh, this one, I need to get a nine on the other side. So the way that I get a nine on the other side is by going four. And then this one is also going to give me a six. And that should work. Um, if it doesn't, then I'm going to have to. This looks like the same mechanism as the one on the other side. Indeed it is. Um, otherwise, we're going to have to. We're going to have to use some points here. Nailed it. All right, good. I'm glad I'm glad Ivy Big Brain can figure out things. Well, you better not dwell on it then. All right. So let's find uh, let's find out uh, find out the origin of the sword left by my mother. Perfect. All right, let's head down. We have to head outside. Oh, this is the end of the episode. Did not get any information out of Von Volner. Yeah, we knew we missed that one. Uh, could have met Peru under strange circumstances. Yeah, I didn't I didn't find Peru at all, but thank you guys so much for hanging out. I do appreciate it. I hope to see you guys in the next episode. Bye!